Hello you guys, it's until the legends here and in this video we are going to be making a TNT cannon because some people don't know how to and I know many of my fans out there do because y'all play factions a ton but this video is for uh, some of y'all who maybe are just like starting factions and stuff or maybe it's just for something else like I don't know many things where you have to make a cannon but yeah maybe you just want to troll people this works on all uh, versions of Minecraft not all versions by that I mean like Xbox and PS4 mobile whatever it is PC like I'm doing it right here so yeah let's get into this video so what you're going to need to start out so you might want to practice this on just a creative world so just open up and make a flat world or something because that will be a lot better and I want to shoot my TNT cannon at this village over here because that will be really funny um, alright so we're going to build ours to shoot all the way over there that will be cool now get any building block you want um, nothing like sand or anything uh, you could make it out of dirt, but just for the sake of the video and because it kind of looks a lot nicer, I'm going to make this with andesite. So let's do that. I'm going to build mine up just a little bit higher so these slimes won't mess with me. Uh, right here sounds good. Um, Alright, this is a good area. So what you are going to do is, yeah, just um, start building something like this. Uh, I'm going to make mine... Now this is like a pretty simple cannon, it's not the simplest, there's like a really simple cannon I'm not going to be showing you how to do, but I'm going to give you a pretty good one and pretty much like the default one uh, everyone uses, so yeah. Um, to start out, just make this 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6 blocks in length, and do something like this, there we go. And now up under it, I have to add like this thing. There we go. So we have this going. Um, now I'm gonna show you because y'all guys in factions, y'all gonna have to like change up your cannon and stuff a lot. So what I'm gonna t show you is pretty much like the fundamentals. We are going to be building a cannon, but normally what you'll do is look right here. Um, you're going to have a button right here so let's get out a button you will need that and get out some redstone while you're here and get out some repeaters all right so now that we have those what you will do is put the button right here and it will trigger a redstone that's there and it will trigger a redstone that's right here now of course the longer you have this the more TNT you will be able to pack in here and it'll go a lot further but I'm not going to be going over that in this video now if you want to maybe you have to shoot very far away but um, that's for more bigger uh, factions and of course if you're probably like watching this you're you're kind of maybe a noob at this so you're probably not going to be going up huge factions like that maybe just a small place like you'll have to shoot from this far and we'll be able to reach it um, with this much okay so yeah and but um, the more advanced you get with this like I watched a video um, I had no clue what to do and I built that and as soon as I mastered that I made like a really tall one and yeah they pretty much just stacked these on top of each other and they shoot so many TNTs so yeah what you do is now is just fill this up with some redstone and this is what it looks like guys um, five repeaters they all have to be pointing in that direction now if I were you I would tick these two so tick them like two times all right there we go and they must all be ticked at the same uh, thing I'm making them go a little bit longer because if they're like that short um, sometimes it will like blow up your cannon so you kind of want it ticked two times I say um, three times is like way too long and it won't work and it'll just like blow up everything so yeah you have to be sure of that and I would build this with um, in creative because you'll probably mess up a lot um, uh, because it can kind of get confusing your first time so now what you do is um, you're going to need a slab of any sort uh, just for the looks I'm probably going to get like a nether brick slab that kind of looks nice 
um, and build on right there. Okay. <clears throat> so now that we've done that, we're going to get a water bucket and put the water bucket um, right here if you want to. Now, if you want a lot more um, space, what you could do is you could break this and you could have that be where the water is. So you could put water there. And then you could fill this part up with TNT. So yeah, so now that you have water uh, flowing through here, because what we're gonna do is place TNT. Now you're gonna place less TNT if you don't want it to go that far. Um, and that's a way to save it, but say it's like really far, uh, we're probably gonna have to stack it up to right here to hit that building over there. So let's do that. Um, put the TNT in right here. Now, like I said, uh, you might wanna test the links first. So I'm just gonna do it with one for the sake of it. Uh, since we're in creative, it doesn't even matter how much I use. And now you see right here what we are doing. What you will do is you're going to put um, you're going to have the redstone make sure this redstone because all this redstone does is it powers up the TNT that's in this like area right here okay like think of this TNT like the bullet and think of these TNTs here like gunpowder okay think of it like that because you're going to be shooting only this TNT and these TNTs right here power up that to make it go further and you also kind of have to uh, put into account that this TNT will go up and drop okay so yeah uh, this will probably uh, with only one TNT powering it will probably only go to probably like right there so keep that in mind and make sure this redstone does not go and light this TNT up because that's what these repeaters will do I forgot earlier we want one repeater like that so yeah the repeaters take a while because you want it takes a while for these to go off I'll show you all here in a second uh, so yeah let's just go with it powers it up and oops guys sorry <laughs> um, this didn't go off there for a second we're going to put block here and put redstone there there we go and actually I kind of want to make it a little bit shorter um, the time and stuff so here we go and I'm going to add some TNT there because I want it to go a little bit further but you see what it's doing and then that lit that TNT up and look it shot it and it goes right there see that's complete um, but now say you wanted it to go even further what we would do is we would power up like this uh, don't worry because see we have that water there um, and we would just put TNT there yeah y'all can pretty much just keep shooting it and it's really that fast um, as long as y'all know oops look we just blew up that area Ooh, we almost got it we can make this a little bit longer if we wanted to add more repeaters and um, stuff we can do that but as long as you get what it's doing so this redstone right here is powering up this TNT um, first like in advance and all these repeaters are doing is slowing it down because we don't want this TNT to ignite first so if you're going to make the TNT go further you don't want it to explode in midair so you're going to want it to ignite a lot um, later on but you also don't want it to be so slow to where this TNT block here is just a solid block um, it has to be like that dropping in a T like it's being ignited so yeah uh, going to add one more of these we're going to expand this a little bit more um, here we go and if you there will get to a point where this water won't flow anymore and that's whenever you've reached the limit in length so you might have to add a double decker like where it's uh, where it will drop TNT down because TNT will stack whenever it's like ignited and stuff if y'all didn't know that so yeah y'all can do that so what we're going to do here is make this a little bit longer um, so we can hit that building because that was kind of the goal so two ticks make sure um, you will mess up a ton and then you'll just blow up all this stuff and you'll have to go and get the resources again and y'all don't want to do that so place down a slab 
um, place that TNT here and here we go make sure I'm just gonna place a block here for no reason but yeah uh, here we go oops that went off early see that's a perfect example of what you don't want to do but anyways I hope y'all got the point um, we're not gonna shoot that I don't feel like rebuilding it but yeah um, I hope y'all guys uh, understand it now I kind of went into a little bit too much detail but y'all will want to make yours uh, your own little cannons and stuff and ideas if you don't have schematica I would get it if I were you to make these cannons a lot faster you don't have to memorize it uh, there's many schematics out there where you can buy well not buy but you can download like schematics with the schematic mod and it'll just build it for you uh, that's a lot easier and you can make your own little schematics uh, I have a tutorial up on my channel for schematica so y'all should go check it out it's one of my most popular videos actually so yeah it has like 10k views I like that a lot and please leave a like if this helped you down in the comments just ask if y'all are having any problems whatsoever and if I sadly couldn't help y'all uh, I know there's many videos out there that will help y'all so yeah that's all there is for this video and you can make this however small or however big you want um so yeah that's all for the video guys and i will see y'all guys in the next one peace